Hello there, ladies and bacteria. <laughs> My name is Bullethead, and I'm gonna be your host with the most. And I just ate a bunch of toast. <laughs> maybe I should kick things off with saying that I just drove in from Milwaukee, and boy, are my arms tired. <laughs> hey, is this thing off? Because I can see you guys, and I know you're out there. Normally, I'd be gloating, but this is even more painful than watching my dad do his comb over. <laughs> we have to do something. Bullet, just read these. If you get stuck, I drew pictures on the back. Hey, thanks, Romeo. I really owe you one. Just share your chicken heads. All right. <laughs> well, thank you for that warm welcome. And I don't want to say our school is rough, but our baseball team is the only one with three strikes before they even play the game. <laughs> Hey, uh, Regina, I just wanted to say that it's really nice to have you back at the school. And I just want to say, bite me, Hightower. <laughs> All right, our first Teacher's Appreciation Award goes to the man who taught us to lose with dignity over and over and over again. Show your love for Coach Cedric Robinson. Thank you for this award. I know that somewhere, Dorothy Dandridge is smiling down on us, and she is proud. It all started in a two-room shack in Willacoochee, Georgia. My dad and John Look, Regina, I, I know you don't want to speak to me, but I got something really important I want to say to you. Look, after all you've been through lately, the last thing I should have done was make it worse by confessing about that pie incident. You know, I got no excuse for my behavior back then. Or now. But you're the best friend I've ever had. And it's just killing me to think that I've hurt you in any way. And one day I'd like to make it all up to you. But if I can't, then I want you to know that I'll always be there for you. No matter what. So off to the big city. <laughs> and then, when I got off that Greyhound bus, I said, Chicago! <laughs> Just like I pitched it. Skyscrapers and everything. <laughs> you know, the Windy City can also be a cold city. <laughs> Hold on, I was just about to get into my Jerry Curl years. <laughs> Okay, and now, show your love for the man who has never worn the same suit twice. Put your hands together for the acting principal and the music teacher, Mr. Steve, they call him Big Daddy Hightower. Lavina, I gotta do something quick. Oh, me too, boss lady. Who wants to listen to Steve? That's my favorite. 